That was an empty box. Yeah. It's, it's under there. Hey guys. Hey guys. This is episode three of Resellers in Cars. Picking trash. And if you did not catch episode two, it is on Brennan's channel. Curious Picker. The Curious Picker. I'll put a link down below in the description. Yeah. Check it out. I really would appreciate it. And I'd like to say, John, uh, thank you for putting your trash out early. Uh, hopefully you're setting the example that we need from the rest of the neighborhood today. So. Yep. We like people who set their trash out early. We've only got, what, 25 minutes or so of light? That sounds about right. So I've got some questions for you, John. All right. Just, uh, we're going to hop right in here. So uh, most of you guys know that uh, obviously we're in Cincinnati. We're both Reds fans, though I'm wearing a Browns hat. Go Browns. Um, Reds had a pretty nice end to the regular season. Uh, we was able to make it to the playoffs and did not score a run in said playoffs. So John is no longer with us. John is now Walt Jockety. He's still the owner, right? Um, Walt Jockety? Yeah. No, Bob Castellini Thanks. is the owner. All right, so cut that out. So John is no longer with us. He is now Bob Castellini. So in this off-season, Bob, what moves, if any, would you make? I'm getting Francisco Lindor from the Indians. Okay. If the, if the asking price isn't too high. Supposedly, last season they wanted too much. You don't have a stop sign. Why is that person stopping? Question. They're waving us off. Okay, yeah. thanks. Um, supposedly last year they tried to get him and the Indians wanted too much. But okay. shortstop is the obvious gap in the Reds lineup. I mean, obviously hitting is not great, but I don't know how you fix that. I mean, they were hitting fine up yeah. until the playoffs for the most part. And then and they ran just fell flat. They ran into two pretty good arms, but... Uh, they were getting hits. They just oh. couldn't get a run. They got like 11 hits in the one game. Did you see something back there? Yeah. That was a... Uh, it's like a leaf blower. Really? Yeah. My guess is that there's potential that it doesn't work. I don't know why else they would throw it out. Right. But... Um, I can't tell if it's a gas or an electric one. Troy built. It's pretty nice. It's gas, I think, because it's got yeah, it's us. gas. Uh, there's some definitely some gunk and stuff all in there. Now it's all over your hands. Yeah, it is. What do you think? I say pass. Okay. I don't want to mess with that unless you do. Yeah. Well, it looked interesting, but little little messy. All right, I'll ask you a sports question. The Browns are three and one right now. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. If you had to put some of your hard-earned money on whether they would finish with nine wins. So we'll set the over under at eight and a half. Would you take over eight and a half wins or under eight and a half wins in the season? Wow. Can I look at the schedule? <laughs> you can look at the schedule. <laughs> um, ooh, so over eight and a half means they've got to win six more games. Yep. Six out of their next 12. Six out of their next 12. So they just have to go 500. Well, you say they just have to go 500, John, but <laughs> this is the first time they've been 3-1 since 2001. Wow. 19 years? Nin 19 years. So, well, that's actually a good box with some uh, packing material. Yeah. Do you want it? Yeah, well, we can swing back. back. Okay. Um, smart Money says under. Yeah? But I'm going to go over. All right. I'm going to go over. I think... I think they got the right coach. Yeah, well, now I'm second guessing myself because Nick Chubb's <laughs> out for Chubb's out for six weeks. But they still got Kareem Hunt. They've got a good offense, I think. Yeah, I'm gonna go over. I'm sticking with it. All right, I'm going over. I'm gonna play this back at the end of the season. See, see how we do. Yeah. Oh wow, that's, that's a, a bunch of. That's a great little box yeah. there. The perfect size. That is a water, water machine. machine. It is. is it the old one? A little detective work says that they bought a new one and threw out the old one. You think we can ask them to use our plug to test it out? <laughs> it's clean. Oh wait, it says pre -mail. Yeah. That's pre -mail. You think they bought it and it doesn't work? 
I'm very confused. I say we throw it in. Think so? I mean, that is. You want the box too? Sure. <laughs> This is a theme here, guys. I just let John do all the work. <laughs> the heavy um, lifting? I just hold the camera. Kind of hang back. All right, we're coming up on the house that every week <laughs> consistently has good stuff out at the curb. But I don't see anything don't yet. See any trash. Right? They've got rid of everything. Yeah, they gave us all the good stuff. So I have another question for you, John. All right. As we are... Uh, I think I said this multiple times on my channel that it feels like our off season season's coming to a close. But now I really feel like it's starting to get pretty, been pretty close here. Yes, it is. Um, oh, look, a dishwasher. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you guys should just grab that one. I'm going to take a picture of it just to get a laugh from Wendy. That's hilarious. Our dishwasher broke recently. We had to get a new one. And I thought it was supposed to get delivered today, but I read it wrong. It's not coming for two weeks. So now I gotta go to the store tomorrow and just get the thing and install it myself, which I'm not looking forward to. Yeah, hopefully installing a dishwasher is not too difficult. I'm sure there's someone on YouTube that can show us how to do it. But uh, yeah, I've never done, never done anything with that. I don't like plumbing. Okay, so you're asking me about the end of the garage sale season. Yes, so end of the garage sale season. Um, I will say that this is the time where for us part-timers, um, I can just kind of slink back to my <laughs> to my full-time job and it's not a big deal. This is where I think you full-timers kind of earn um, a lot of your stripes. So I know you've got a pretty decent net of people where you can kind of get, you know, product from and things yeah. like that, but what are your, do you have any plans, concerns about the upcoming off garage sale season for product? Not so much, only because I've been doing it now for Oh wait, there's a nice stand back there. Yeah. I'm gonna back up. Sure. Um, only because I've been selling full time now for about seven years. Got it. So I've kind of gotten accustomed to what to do and how to find stuff, and I've got a decent backlog right now of inventory. I was gonna say, do you do you it's backlog? A really interesting stand. So there's an empty box. Yeah. It's, it's under there. It might be the. This has not been open. All right. Yeah. Grab that. This thing is kind of cool. Or what's in that bag? Probably just garbage. Oh. Yeah. We'll take. Oops. We'll take it. I think it's trash. There's a mint on a bench in. Say a mensch on a bench. Mensch on a bench. Mensch on a bench. You guys probably can't see that. So it's for nine ninety nine, brand new. Um, update from last week: we got um, the coffee table and end table, and I have them listed on Facebook Marketplace uh, for seventy five dollars for the pair. So hopefully those sell. Another toilet. There's two toilets on the street. Everyone's getting rid of their toilets. Ooh, and there's a. Uh, Is that a kind of like car seat? Yeah. And a base. Oh, wait, there's a lot of stuff here. There's a ton of stuff here. The Kiko? Yeah, it's a Click Connect. Snug Ride. Can you, you can't sell the base? I think you can sell the bases. Yeah. I think so. Yeah, Draco. Draco. Does this back part connect? Disconnect? I think so. Yep, there we go. Cool. Want the base? Yeah. Need a tub. Do not need a tub. No. Boxes. Nice. So, do you buy product throughout the year, like kind of in stocking up mode? Like, do you keep certain things that just don't list them for a while? Or? Not necessarily, no. but um, I guess the fall and the winter is when I kind of get caught up. Gotcha. Because I typically buy so much during the summer at garage sales, I can't list it all. Yeah, that makes sense. You want boxes? Uh, yeah, I'll take this. It's nice and very nice boxes. All right, we are 
officially done. That's it. <clears throat> Pretty it successful is. night. Yeah. So that's three three straight weeks, and the uh, van is full. Yep. And it's time to go eat some uh, Brenner. Time to eat some Brenner. Thank you for watching, guys. We'll see you next time. Yep. You guys have a good one.